Janimba, Janimba. Okay, no. Hello, guys. It's me, Bokusatsu, or Aaron, or Aaron, want to call me. So today, we are going to review the Dragon Stars Janimba. I had the guy since last week. So yeah. Also, want to say this. Happy Thanksgiving. Stay home with your family, wear a mask as well, and eat some fat turkey. <laughs> so, let's go on with this figure. What do I like, what do I like about this figure? Well, uh, first I, I want to get, I want to talk about the negatives. There are a lot of negatives about this guy, which I do not, I like. First off, Yeah, my copy is a wobbly. And the freaking. And the freaking fucking bell. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, anyway, my copy is a uh, wobbly, which isn't good. <sighs> That's just sad. <clears throat> so, articulation. Well, another bad thing. Look at this. Why did he have a hard time? What a face. Ah, much better. You know this? Ooh, no. Well, that's just great. The articulation, uh, good. But he's loose, which is pretty sad to be honest with you. <sighs> so. But how is it for your other arm? Like, well, he's limited. This, this is what you can do for articulation, which is not good. He, ah, uh, dang. He, he's, uh, I'm not impressed right now. I think the Super Saiyan Bardock is the better version between the two. This is sad to be honest with you. No, I'm just kidding. I like that Bardock. So he comes with some accessories with other hands. He has another hand you could put on his other side so you could put, like, put the sword on here. And and here are his grabby hands. Don't know where he have these for. He have another punching hand. That's pretty much it. The colors of the figure look just like the ones from the movie. Which is, which is pretty cool. Cool color, but the articulation and the wiggly and his feet are wiggly or loose. Yeah, that's, that's bad. It's somewhat almost almost so it's almost somewhat at the same level as the MCU Marvel Legend Task Taskmaster. And you guys know how much that figure is bad as well. So for side comparison, here he is right next to the SA figure Zamasu, Mer Zamasu. And here he is with his best friends, the Dragon Star. Super, super Gogeta. Somewhat, Go somewhat Gogeta seems, Janimba seems taller, or even with Gogeta, which is pretty good, to be honest with you, which I do enjoy and like. And here he is, right next to the SA figure arts, Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta, or Gogeta. Yeah, yeah, right now, here, yeah, right now to the SH Figure Arts Best Selection Comrade Build. Again, he's taller than both of them. Damn, damn, you know, it's a, you know, what, pretty big, but not big as dragons are cooler, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, right next to the Lightning Collection Blue Beast Morpher Ranger. The Red Beast Morpher Ranger, or you want to call by the Sentai version, Red Buster and Blue Buster. 
Yeah, he's taller than both of them. So what do I think? Overall, this guy, my my version, my copy, he's not a good figure. I'm sorry, guys. He, he's not a good figure. If I had to make a list through the best to worst, this guy, this guy would probably be number eight. I was hoping for him to be a good figure, but no, I was, my copy, I was disappointed, sadly. I will use him for posts. I will play with him. Not like that, but you know what I mean. But overall, my Drag Sergeant Nimba is a good figure. My copy. I hope you guys, hope you guys enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, and also post that notification bell on for more video and follow my Instagram for Instagram at Bokusatsu and my Vimeo account I do Comrade Dubs. My name's Aaron and happy Thanksgiving. You know, you know, a lot of turkey. I'm out. Peace.